Welcome at the presentation of organizational integrity. I'm Jos van der Aalst, Principal Consultant Asset Management for Stork Technical Services. Oil and gas operators are committed to deliver excellent safety, health and environmental performance while being profitable. Despite this commitment, we all know examples where hazards became major incidents. How to prevent this? How to realize this commitment? In the context of oil and gas, we use the broad definition of organizational integrity, integrated, consistent approaches and behaviors leading to knowing what are the right things to do and doing the right things. This is broader than the fight against corruption or being compliant. Human integrity is, of course, a cornerstone of organizational integrity. Oil and gas companies need to manage a complex portfolio of risks. A lot of these risks are associated with the operation and management of their facilities and assets. These risks can lead to minor or major incidents. These incidents are potentially impacting several oil and gas business values, the business continuity, loss of profitability, the customer delivery, the sustainability commitment, or the company's image. What are root causes of these incidents? Asset-related root causes, yes, of course, but also a lot of other root causes. The organization was not ready, not always a good understanding of the hazards, a lack of investment, not the desired behavior, and this was tolerated by the management, and so on. This shows that not only asset integrity is important, but perhaps even more important, the organizational integrity, the processes and people. What to do to assure that these potential causes will not lead to an incident? We have to install preventive barriers, asset integrity barriers, but also organizational integrity barriers, policy and strategy barriers, processes and organization barriers, people-related barriers, and means or infrastructure barriers. If the hazard even then becomes an incident, we need to install mitigation barriers to minimize as much as possible the impact of the hazard realization. To end up where we started, oil and gas operators are committed. They face a complex portfolio of risks. The key performance success factor is realizing outstanding asset and organizational integrity. If you want to learn more, you can go to the website of Oil and Gas Fundamentals. Thank you very much.